Are Tesco's PLC a good long-term investment stock? Looking at the company's revenue, revenue is going nowhere. They're stuck and they're capped at about 60 billion a year. In fact, in recent years, that's dropped about low 50s. We're back up to the 60s now, but this is a company that just can't seem to get past that 60 billion mark. Over the last 15 years, profit's been sitting about three or 4% a year. That's not enough. That's too paper thin, doesn't give them enough money left over at the end of each year to reinvest into further growth. It's just not enough there. Debt levels are too high. In 2021, they were at 14 times earnings. That's just, they're biting off more than they can chew. In 2020, share price sat at £2.50 a share. Today, this stock sits at £2.50 a share. That tells you pretty much what you need to know. Over the last 25 years, there's a company that have not been able to grow. Not a bad dividend stock. They pay 4.5% dividend. That's not bad. But if share price growth is what you are looking for over the next 5, 10, 15 years, Tesco, not the right company.